Hi, I'm Meg Johnson and welcome to today's awesome person video. So today's awesome person is my friend from junior high school, Jamie. And Jamie and I have been friends since I moved to Utah in seventh grade. And she was always really cool and everybody always loved her and she was, she was awesome. Well, she still is. She's still quite amazing. <laughs> and so my story about Jamie and she, there are plenty of stories about her that I could, you know, describe as why she's the awesome person today. But specifically, I want to tell you about a time after I was paralyzed. And at this time, she was married and she was living in Georgia. And she has, you know, children and she's just a busy mom and all that. Um, but she was visiting Utah for just a, you know, I don't know for how long, just a little trip. And um, so, and this is when I was newly paralyzed, so the first summer that I was paralyzed. And, and just kind of something interesting about spinal cord injuries, like I am, is we can't control our temperature. Well, quadriplegics like me. Like, we can't control our temperature. Like, if it's hot, we're hot. If it's cold, we're cold. And, and in, the, in the beginning of being paralyzed, like I've been paralyzed almost 13 years, and it's gotten a ton better. Um, and I've found some tricks that work, like scarves. <laughs> but in the beginning, um, it was really, really a challenge for me to control my temperature. And even though it was the middle of the blazing Utah summer, I was constantly cold. Like my, my internal thermostat was just totally out of whack. And I was shivering constantly and just so cold. And just to relieve some of that, this one day, my neighbor invited me over to come sit in her hot tub. And uh, that was just wonderful because water helped a ton. So if it was hot air or hot water, that seemed to help the most. And so I'm sitting in her hot tub and it feels so good. And I'm sitting all the way up to my ears, you know, just my little nose is, you know, peering out from the water, you know, just so I can get as much of me submerged in this hot water as possible. And it, and it is quite, quite the relief. Like it feels really good. And I'm there for an hour, two hours, three hours. <laughs> I'm there for a really long time. And I'm so, you know, I'm, I'm just so happy to not be so cold because it just felt like it was snowing inside me constantly. Um, but it just felt so good to be in this hot tub. But a rule at our neighbor's house was that you can't be in the hot tub all by yourself. And so even though that it's the middle of the blazing Utah summer, outside in this hot tub, my neighbor, and her name's Melanie, and it's very, very likely that I'm going to do an awesome person about Melanie later. <laughs> Maybe we'll just combine them this time. Oh my gosh, she's quite amazing all by herself. But she didn't want to break her family rules. And so she has been in the hot tub with me this whole time. One hour, two hours, three hours. But she doesn't have a problem with her temperature. She's just normal. And if it's hot outside, she gets, you know, she just gets hot, you know, because her body, her body can regulate itself, you know, but she can feel the heat and she can feel the cold. And I mean, she's just a normal person. <laughs> but she's been in the hot tub with me this whole time and she is not up to her ears. She's not, you know, way down deep like I am. She's holding me and helping me, you know, be stable, but she is as out of the hot tub as she possibly can be because <laughs> it's just so hot. And so about this time, one, two, three hours later, my friend Jamie comes over to Melanie's house to find me. Jamie grew up in that same neighborhood, so she knows Melanie, and, and she and I are friends, and so she comes to see me because she knows that I've been paralyzed not too long before, and so she comes over to Melanie's backyard, and she and I are visiting, and, and Jamie's wearing just a t-shirt and, and long jeans. That's all she's wearing, t-shirt and long jeans, and, um, and some shoes. And uh, she's looking at us, and we're visiting a little bit, and she keeps looking back and forth between me and then Melanie and me and then Melanie. She says, Melanie, you are so, you're like turning bright red like a lobster. <laughs> you need, you know, let's, let's get out. And Melanie says, oh, I can't. Because our family rule is that you can't be in the hot tub by yourself. You have to have someone with you all the time. And Jamie says, what? Are you sure? You're bright red like a lobster. Like it's too hot for you. And Melanie says, no, that's the family rule. And Jamie says, well, okay. And so Jamie takes off her shoes and steps one leg and the other leg, both legs have pants on at one time, so like into the hot water and sits down and, you know, holds on to me so I can be stabilized. 
and Melanie doesn't even think twice. She just jumps out of that hot tub and, you know, tries to tries to cool down a little bit because she really is bright red like a lobster. And I'm still, you know, up to my ears, you know, up to my nose in the water. And Jamie is holding on to me now. And Jamie is sitting there with me in the hot tub, in her t-shirt, in her jeans. I mean, I just think, you know, Jamie's just got this, She's like a superhero, you know, with her own little slogan, you know, something's wrong, not for long. <laughs> like, you know, she's a problem solver and she's going to do whatever needs to be done at that moment. Poor Melanie probably didn't have time for Jamie to decide, oh, well, I'll just go back to where I'm staying and I'll just go grab my swimsuit, you know. No, Jamie just jumped right in. And I think we can all be an awesome person just like Jamie just like Jamie is, and just jump in with both feet, not even caring what we're wearing, not even caring what that's going to mean for us, but just jumping in with both feet to whatever problem is at hand, whatever problem is before us. This is how we be an awesome person, as we be just like Jamie was. And Melanie also, but but this, this story is about Jamie. We'll do Melanie another time. So thank you so much for watching my awesome person of the day. There's more videos for you to watch if you want to click on some of these. Um, or if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe. Come and visit me on my website, www.megjohnsonspeaks.com. And I'd also love to connect with you on Facebook or Instagram. So come and find me there. Those links are down below in the description. So we'll see you next time.